Top 5 new features that you should know with Flutter 2.8 Flutter released the version 2.0 early this year, but what made 2.8 even better? The first thing they did is to work on the mobile performance. In the new article, they just announced that upgrading to Flutter 2.8 should start faster your apps and use less memory. The next crazy thing with this new release is the new sign-in widget that uses Firebase to handle authentication. This new widget should handle the two-factor authentication and the reset password user flow. It should also make much easier the Google, Apple, Twitter or Facebook authentication. The third one is not really a feature, but it's a big win for the Flutter community. A few months ago, there were more than 200,000 Flutter apps in the Play Store, and they just announced that the number of Flutter apps has nearly doubled, with more than 375 apps now only in the Play Store. This just confirmed the Flutter momentum will create more job in the future and expand bigger and bigger the Flutter community. In more simple words, it means Flutter to the moon. Next, we have one of my favorite announcements. The version one of Flame has been released. Flame is currently the best way to create games with Flutter, even though I think Unity is better, this is still a big step for the Flutter mobile game development. A couple weeks ago, I made my first Flutter game with Flame. I will add the video at the end of this one. The next thing is about Dart. You can now create tear-offs from a constructor. The example they give us is you can create a list of text widgets. You can click the playlist available on the screen to see more about Flutter of the day, inspired by Flutter widget of the week. I also created a Flutter mobile game with Flame. Feel free to subscribe if you want to learn more about Flutter. I will add in the description our Flutter course. Bye.